Hey guys, Billy Jenkins here with Silver Creek Doodles. Today is just an update from us of what's all going on here at Silver Creek Doodles. So it is January 31st. I just wanted to give you an update of what's going on here. So we just said goodbye to Shay and Brantley's puppies. They left this last weekend and early this week. So it's a Tuesday now. So we had puppies go home Sunday and Monday. So it's our first morning waking up without Share Brantley's puppy. So we really enjoyed them while they were here. We have kept up to date with our families and they're super happy and doing really well with them. But I just kind of wanted to give you an update of what's going on here. So let's go ahead and take a walk through our place. All right, well there is little Miss Josephia. And if you've not heard about her, we are almost four weeks post leg surgery with plates and screws. Good girl. So we'll talk more about that. I do have a video coming of, of what happened, but that's little Miss Josephia. Here's Miss Millie. We are waiting very patiently for her heat cycle to come in. Hey, pretty girl. She's due any time, but we are patiently waiting. And everybody else is just hanging out, enjoying themselves. Hey, Miss Ariel. Hey, Dodd. There's my David, just hanging out. Hey, pretty boy. Mama loves you, yeah? Mama loves you. And here is Miss Eleanor. So she was quite small when we got her, but she has gained over five pounds within the last couple days, and she is just <laughs> exploding. So this is her retirement litter. So she is due in just a few days. Come here, Eleanor. Come on. Good girl such a pretty girl. Got her all groomed up a couple days ago too. So here's Miss Mama Katie. She got her groom done. She is a little thin, but that's why we are going to let her go home next week. Good job, Miss Katie. Good job. We also have my daughter's two dogs here. She has been at the hospital with her preemie son, which is our grandchild. So we have two of the three of her dogs here. We groomed them yesterday, but they're just waiting very patiently for their mama and new human brother to get home. Yeah. And dad, of course. Your dad's favorite, huh? Your dad's favorite. All right, so we also have Katie's litter of 12. So as you've seen, Katie got her bath. Katie got all cleaned up. She's gonna be going home next week. But here's her babies. They are four weeks and a couple days old. Hey guys, Katie and Finn's litter of 12. So besides Eleanor, she is due pretty much any day, you know, her due date, we actually have down for Thursday, but you know, we're, you know, taking temperatures, everything's normal as of right now, but we've got her area set up. We're just kind of waiting for her. So it's kind of a waiting game, but she's not showing any sign yet. And we should know within 24 hours, kind of her nesting and temp drop and different stuff like that. So we don't know that yet. So the only other dog, well, two dogs. So the only other golden doodle that we have bred right now. We don't know if she's pregnant. It's Miss Olivia. So we bred Olivia and Kevin together and we don't know yet if, if she's pregnant, but we will be able to do an ultrasound in about probably three and a half to four weeks. We'll see. So we've also got the Labradoodle litter. So our Australian Labradoodles. So we have Emma and Mitchell. So we have bred these two. We'll know in a week if she's pregnant. Super excited. We have had some people hop on the list. So we've got a few more spots available. If you're interested in that, you can hop on. So Emma and Mitchell's litter do have their own separate wait list, but our golden doodles are all on a bulk wait list. So as of right now, we've got Eleanor that's fixing to have her puppies. And of course we've got our wait list for that. And then we've got Olivia that she should be pregnant. So she's going to be right behind that. So all of our upcoming letters are on our upcoming letter page on our website. So don't forget to take a peek at that. But I have some families that are just asking for an update. Let me know what's going on. Who are you breeding? What are you doing? But we try to keep 
our website up to date with everything you know go in you know there's a few things that are kind of duplicated stuff listed everywhere so a lot of times i've got to make sure that i've updated every single page but don't forget to go on there and take a peek you know our bernie doodles we don't have any bread yet we actually have we've had a little bit of a hard time breathing the bernie doodles and you can see that in our past videos but it is what it is so we'll just have to see you know what goes up we've got dixie we've got danny deborah um who else do we have you have cc as well but she's not came into heat yet so we'll just have to see kind of you know what's going on we've tried to breed dixie deborah and danny we've had no good outcome of that so we're just gonna have to see you know i don't know if it's something with the bernie doodles you know something that i don't think it's something that we've done wrong but we've just got to really try to hit it hard next time because we do have people on our wait list for the bernie doodles so Go to my website though and check that out because everything should be up to date on there let me know if you have any questions again the golden doodles everything is up to date on there of who's been bred which is two girls as of right now our upcoming litters and we are waiting when it's heat time and heat cycles if i have on there you know expected to come into heat at a certain time nature is nature you know i've got one girl josie you know our, our older josie we have little miss josephia too but our older josie is actually almost this well next month this coming up month tomorrow february will be two years since she had her last heat kind of weird so i don't know if she's had like silent heats or or what's been going on i don't know but we have our families like keeping a lookout on it you know we've taken her to the doctor a few times to the vet to get her checked out everything is normal she's just not really coming to heat so we're waiting you know when heat cycles are nature breeding is nature we're here to help and kind of do and, and make everything fall in line but sometimes you know it's nature and we just can't help it so i hope this helps you out just to kind of hear a little bit of what's going on i don't want to talk too much because visit my website everything on there is up to date i'll have down in the description below listed the websites of you know the different pages of the golden doodles plan litters bernie doodles aussie doodles i didn't talk much about them but i don't really have to we do have Millie and Pickles and Shay and Pickles listed and we've already got people on the list so if you want to hop on there's a few more spots on there let me know but they're 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 getting filled up pretty quick thanks for listening thanks for watching if it's your first time here don't forget to hit that subscribe link give us a thumbs up if you like what we're doing and we'll see you next time bye